Hello and welcome. The following video may not be suitable for all audiences, so please take extra care when viewing. Thank you and enjoy. Do you have a mortar and pestle at your base, I hope? Oh, I didn't think I saw that. Okay. Maybe I'll... Maybe I'll head back to... Yeah... It's probably safer out there as well. I'm here, so... Is that a threat? <laughs> I can ban you if you brief me. <laughs> Trying to look at, because the, because it's night time, and I'm sailing. I'm just looking around at the like the, the lights in the sky, trying to work out where I am. Insanity. A raptor. He's What's it called? Insanity. Insanity. Yes. Yeah. Insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting different results. <laughs> So, are there any Carnotaurus living near base these days? Uh, there will... There was... One up the hill. I can't, I can't open it, so... Sometimes I just pick the herbs nearby in the hope that maybe the triangle button will appear when I'm not looking at herbs. God, it's so bright. If I sneak up on it. Before we had to load the servers again, I called the I renamed Raft Rafty McRaft Face. 
Oh, it's, it's now just called Raft again. Which I think is a great loss. It's the worst loss. Even more, even more lost than your dinosaurs all dying. <laughs> I'm used to it. I'm used to it now. Yeah. Oh, they gave the raptors proto feathers. I, in fact, no, they gave them just real feathers. Those are not proto feathers, those are just feathers. <laughs> I've never been close enough to a raptor for long enough and not either killing it or dead. <laughs> to look at it in that much detail. I was going to bring this mortar and pestle, but it seems like it would be an extremely bad idea to put it in my base, a place where there's no resources in which to use it. So I was wondering if maybe we could place it at your base. Okay. Like, the thing I need to make from it is like spark powder. There are no rocks where I live, so can't really make spark powder. Don't have rocks. I just restocked the preserving box of bears, by the way, with spark powder. Oh crap. Oh, so you actually have to do that? Yeah, it runs out all the time. Okay. No, it powers the preserving box. We have some more. Horrible sea monster in the water, by the way. Um, I don't know, I took damage though, so. I, I was swimming with two of them and they didn't hurt me. Whatever's there now is aggressive, I, I, I don't know what it is though. Oh, I might show up a supply crate. It didn't even give me the option to do it, but it did it anyway. Um, it had, it had wool armor in it, shall I just throw it away? Primitive cloth. Yeah, cloth armor. No, no cloth. Like, the base tier stuff. What the hell just went that? I'm gonna put it in this chest that's by spawn in case some new comes along.
Okay. Spark powder lasts one minute in a campfire cooking pot of a firing forge in a stove fireplace. But it lasts 13 minutes in a standing torch and 30 minutes in a preserving bin. And it's used in a preserving bin to make perishables like meat and berries last 10 times longer. Um, so a stack of 100 will keep the preserving bin, preserving bin running for 2 days and 2 hours, for example. And a stack is would be crafted with 50 flint and 50. Um, This compi is not attacking oh, so me. Says I use spark powder. It says you can use spark powder oil and cooked meat to make jerky for hour, uh, over hours in the preserved bin. Interesting. Oil? Yeah. Like the crude oil we keep finding. I don't know. Just says oil. Oil and yeah. I'm guessing jerky will last a lot longer as well. Yeah, you can. Right, time for me to go. I got up a quarter to five this morning. Good for you. No. Bad for me. It was, it was very nice. It was all the bits of the day preceding that that weren't as great. Are you saying that probably because you have to get up to look after small children? No, it wasn't too early this morning. Ah, new world, new life. It's Brontosaurus near me. Hello, Brontosaurus. I think it's Brontosaurus. It's a long neck, full stop. Let's see what's still in my house inventory. Actually, I think last time I was here, someone destroyed one of my boxes. Yeah, it was. A, I think it was a dippy. I keep I'm not I'm not I'm choosing to call them the proper name. Um So whereabouts is your house? Because I know where Zyphus is, he's across the water from me. Um it's hard to explain. But if you I've got a simple bed here. Okay, kill myself and be on my way. Actually no, if I go back to the house bed I should be able to. Um, I'll see if I can... If I go over to another simple bed, which we should have at the house, I think I can transport. I'll have to yeah. forget all my stuff for a little while. Actually, that might be a bad thing. Well, mine's... I think mine is the most right-hand one. Either that or the most left-hand one. I mean, actually... I've got a red X on one of them, which might be where I am. I think a red X means you died. So, yeah, I might have respawned. Well, if I respawn, then I'll respawn here. That's fine, it's like a bit of a Right. I'm actually not going to use the bed to teleport, I'll just use the bed to figure out where you are. Because I'm worried it about... It is quite dangerous to get here. Yeah, I'm worried about um, dropping all my I stuff. I did get attacked by a uh, alligator on the way. And giant snakes. Fun time! Um, I mean, I teleported and dropped everything. You can just go back and pick it all up whenever you're ready. I need to pop five. It doesn't and I need disappear. To pop to the water because I'm dehydrated. I'm also out of energy. I'm actually quite hungry as well, but uh, I obviously don't have any food. Uh... We used to have better dinosaurs around here, but they seem to have become more boring now. I think there is Such like. A good thing and a bad thing. I mean, I think Zyphus said the year is a ridiculously long time period. I was about to say maybe the seasonal. 
of migrating, but that might be a bit mm. much of an ask. I still laugh at the pipes. The pipe system is ridiculous. Yeah. I mean, you've had a hard enough time putting it together. Yeah, no, the pipes are tops destroyed, I think. Uh. That's what I had said. Well, the pipe seems to be okay. Maybe it's a part of the pipe. Right, I'm scavenging to get some food because I'm going to get food soon. Okay. Uh, I'm going to the seeds as well. They probably don't. Actually, no, there's one seed I don't want to eat, which is this rock carrot seed. Or a rock arrot. Which I assume is going to become a carrot. But I could be wrong. I just heard some running men, but I don't know what it was from. I'm going to see if I can investigate all these massive structures. Uh, hmm. Are you far to the left or far to the right? I think left. Okay, I think those two beds are Zyphrus. I don't think you're actually that far away from where my base was. Um. Oh, that was close. I jumped off the cliff and almost landed on our spike wall. Which would have been fun. So guys, I'm going to steal the raft. I've never driven one of these before, so this will be interesting. A bit annoying, but not too bad. Just be careful of crocodiles yeah. and leeches. Turn. Yeah, I think we've all gone in sort of the similar direction. There's my location. That was Cypress's location. And then we're at the Sandhawk buildings. We have two of them there. I think technically Zyphrus has made his house on Herbivore Island. Mm. Although I know from him that there's not just herbivores. <laughs> I'm coming down the river now, so I don't know how far down the river you are. Are you on... Are you like close to the red structure? Uh, ish, yeah. No, I think last time we came down this river we did get attacked by Sark though. He's a big creature. It's probably Sarko. Or a leech. Right. Are you near a waterfall? 
No. Okay. Okay, you can't just reverse the bullet, you actually have to turn it. Yeah. Yeah, that's Sarko. This bullet is impossible to turn. Right, turn. Oh. Look at your map. Uh, oh, hello. Something's changed. Uh. We've now got a pointer where we are. Do we? Yep. <gasps> At least I do. I do too. So I must have unlocked something. So where on your map are you? Um, right. Do you know... Very aware that there is a circle on the beach near me. Do you know there's three islands on the left hand page? Yep. You've got the one with the big circle in the middle. Yep. The big pond in the middle. Yep. Um, That's and right. then the one to the left of that has like a little pond. Yep. I'm on the very right hand side of that island. Okay. Right. Oh, hello, monkey. Ah! I think a monkey just stole something out of the box that was on this raft. I hope it wasn't something important. That's what I get for sitting still for so long. So you're actually, yeah, so I think basically you and Zyphus have sort of all ended up in a similar place. Because I've built my island on this, uh, out. So there's like a cliff with rocks on the top of it. That's where oh. I've built. Zyphus is just opposite me on an island. I don't think the raft can go through here, you know. Yep. Right, you can't. You definitely can't go that way. Yeah, this is this is how that craft gets turned now. Right, no. I don't think the raft will get through here, there are literally stones in the way. Although I did just clip into a pit of a wall, so maybe. No. No, maybe. Yes. I'm forcing my whiff down this river. Or trying to. Right, I think I've hit the is there a giant long neck near you? It's Valheim all over again. I did this before, I got stuck like in a river mouth on Valheim and had to get off the uh, and clear the way forward. <laughs> All the level 45 carpenters took a while. Oh. Uh, quick, eat more of those. in the boat. Check on what's in the chest that I've stolen. Nothing. No. I'm off! With my spear in hand, I'm off to find the problem. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Okay, that's fine. I didn't throw it. I threw it that time. I think you actually pick up your spear automatically. Uh, yes. Yeah. It's on the right hand side of this island. Or at least he thinks he's on the right hand side of this island. Hello, giant creature. 
Hello, take me. Although you're running away from something, which generally means something's attacked you. That's a Sarko. Don't want to be near the Sarko. Oh god. But run, 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 run. Sarko is going to kill me. Yep, Sarko is going to kill me. Hi. You want to play that game? People love 15 Sarko. I could see it coming for me and I couldn't run. I was hungry. I missed your house. Do you think? Hello. Hello. Meeting a yeah, I walked right past your house. I didn't realise you were up here. I'm literally just down on the beach. Actually, I don't need any food right now because I'm full from being respawned. But yeah, I was at the legs of the Brontosaurus on your beach and ri oh, <laughs> the river yeah, mouth yeah. is where the raft is. So if you look right, you'll see the raft. Oh, yeah. I got stuck there. <laughs> got off the raft, got found myself a sarco. Oh, that was a bit of a drop. Oh, um, if you want the uh, note as well. That's the very right hand side. Ooh, the flying thing over here. Uh, is that a pterodon? Nice. Well, sound from like. Ooh. There's a big crocodile thing over there. Yeah, Sarko's in the middle of a fight by the looks of it, which is good because I. I would like to get my stuff back and my stuff is over here. Sarko lost. Oh, no, no, no. oh okay. It's I think it's the the creature we keep following zebras and stuff like that. I think they seem to be quite defensive. There's a great possibility that Brontosaurus is just a walk over. Yeah. yeah. I got all my stuff back though. You're a very nice turtle. I like you, Chris. <laughs> oh, a raptor. Oh, the raptor. Goodbye, oh, yeah. raptor. The over raptor ones are the ones that I always think are aggressive, but they're not. <laughs> they just sound horrible when they call. Oh, frogs on its way. Usually means heat. It's telling me I'm too hot. I wish somewhere there was an indicator that I was running. The um, dust cloud seems to make the lights a bit weird as well. Because the purple and green light of the, the shards <coughs> off north, or what I'm calling north, are much Easier to spot because they've gone less translucent. But yeah, Yumi and, and Cyphus because we all headed in the same direction but landed at different points. So if you look directly south towards the sparkly beacon, that set of rocks is my home. Hello again. Here. I knew I hadn't gone too far, but... Thank 
you for sticking through to the end of this video. And if you like what you saw and want some more, why not hit the like button, maybe subscribe, and then check out one of the videos or playlists soon popping up on the screen. Or just head over to the channel for even more options. Already subscribed? Then hit the bell icon here or on the channel and get notified when new videos go live. As well as being here, you can also find us over on Twitter and Instagram. Links are provided in the description below. But either way, it's bye for now, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day.